I'm Tony King with Zerion, and today I'm going to give you a tip on Epicor Eclipse on how to use the reorder pad in E-Term and Solar. Reorder pad. The reorder pad is very functional from a sales perspective. It allows you to pull up a rolling 365 days of history for an in particular customer and allows you to select items that they recently bought to put them onto the order either one at a time or multiple at a time. I'm in a sales order with no items on it and I'm going to hit the reorder pad hotkey which is on the lower right hand side of the screen. In the reorder pad, the reorder pad shows you 365 days of history for this in particular customer for all the items that they have purchased. What's nice about the reorder pad is that you can, also, you can see what the availability quantity is, what their last quantity was, but you can also put in several different items at once to purchase. So you just fill in the quantities on the right hand side, hit escape, and it will put all three of those items on the order. For those of you that do not have the reorder pad operational or when you hit the reorder pad nothing comes up, what you need to do is go to F8, go to F2, end of month reports 2, and generate the customer product by demand index. When you do this, then it will populate 365 days of history into all the customers and the reorder pad will now work. Moving over to solar, I'm going to show you how to use the reorder pad in solar as well. So once again, I'm in the body of a ticket. There's no items on the order at all. And I can select edit order and go to reorder pad. In solar, the order quantity is actually on the left-hand side of the screen, but the same applies. It shows you 365 days of history for this in particular customer, and I can put in any number of quantities for any number of products that I want. I just close the screen, accept the quantities, and it puts those items onto the ticket. In solar as well, you can go ahead and uh, turn on the customer product demand index by going to reports, end of month reports 2, generate customer product by demand index, and when you click begin then it will go ahead and populate the reorder pad for all of your customers. Thanks for watching the tip of the day from Zerion on Epicor Eclipse, how to use the reorder pad in solar and e -term.